could harm his children. And that includes your son. It's not good enough. We had a deal. Carl broke it. Paulina, get your coat. No, Joe, you go where you like. Dante and I are staying with Rachel. Excuse me? I'm not leaving. Nikos is running wild. Carl is God knows where. This is not what I agreed to. Do you think I would let my children stay in this house if I thought it wasn't safe? Rachel, if you would be straight with me about where Carl oh, so is... Oh, so Rachel does what you want, then I get to stay here? Why can't you just back me on this? <sighs> because, Joe... <gasps> Paulina, I'm so glad they finally let you and Dante out of the hospital. Take Dante upstairs. Thank you. You're gonna ignore what I want. Mm, help. Just take him. Dante doesn't need to watch while we settle this. Hello? Can you? Can somebody give me... Hey, hey, would you hey, help me out here for a second? Hey, okay, calm down now. What's going on? So I'm looking for Paulina. She's not She's not in the room, and I'm not getting any help all around right, here. All right, all right, all right. Fine, but Paulina and Dante just left. Do you have any idea where she is, Michael? I mean, you have to see the house. It's a wreck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Joe came. He took him over to Rachel's. And, and you're sure Paulina's okay? Because she's got to be freaked well, out yeah, about Dante. Well, yeah, she's... Dom. Look, it was a close call, but they're both fine. Another thing, Michael, who, who is who is Dr. Slater? I mean, where is Shane Roberts when you need him? Jake, Shane Roberts just left a letter of resignation on my desk. I just found it. So he is leaving now. Why don't we just sail off someplace? Mm, never to be heard from again. Now, where would that be? Oh, I don't care. Mm. As long as we could be like this forever. Mm. Yeah, well, forever's almost there, Lila, at least for me. We got last night. Yeah, and the night before that. <laughs> mm. If it weren't for you, I'd be alone on my last days on Earth. Don't think about that, Angie. Okay. Think about living. Mm -hmm. What? What? I've got an idea. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. Why don't we just pick a place on the map, just close our eyes, and go. What do you say? Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> I like that idea. Okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> Where is it? Ontario. Too cold. Too cold. No. All right, let me try again, okay? Mm. Greenland? Oh, no, no. Oh, I'm gonna go someplace south. Nice and warm. Come on over here. Will you help me pick a beach of some kind? You, think you can't be sure of that, Shane, Lila, please. Listen to me. Listen to me. Listen to me. I have a little time left, okay? I want to enjoy it. Tell him. Tell him now that the medicine is working. Even if he goes back to Vicky. There's a little bit of hope. Lila, Lila, that medication, I do not want to spend the rest of my life drugged. Okay? If you take the medication... No, Lila, Jane. listen to me. I don't want to live the rest of my life in a fog. I want to live the rest of my life and the time I have left with you clear. Please, headed. please, if you take the medication... No. Boat at North in the 
now listen to me. You know that if I was getting well, this would be different. It's just, it's just not the way it was before. Now stop this, okay? Stop this. Let's go pick a place to sail to. Now come on, come on, come here. Shane, you've got to take the medicine. Enough you about the medicine, about Lila. The medicine, enough Shane. about the medicine. Shh, shh, please. No the, more about the medicine, the okay? Medicine. We have to live for right now. Warm. Yes. Sounds good. A beach. A beach. <laughs> a beach. No. A desert. That place in the movies. What's that? Uh, what movie? Come on now. What movie? Nothing. Morocco. Come yeah. on. <laughs> Casablanca. Oh, that's yeah, it. That's yeah, yeah, it. That's yeah. it. Okay. You and I, we will be the um, adventuresome Americans, and we'll spend all our time in cafes listening to lonely men play the piano. I'll buy a great big hat. <laughs> I promised you, when we were married, that I would take you anywhere you wanted to go. And I failed at that. But now maybe I can do that for you. We go to Morocco? Yes, I do. Did, uh, did Shane say if he was coming back? No, he, he didn't mention that in his letter, but you know Shane, he shortened him, among okay. other things. Well, he's a good doctor. Listen, Michael, I, I talked to Vicky. I know that she told you that, that Shane is dying. Yeah. Look, uh, he didn't mention it to anybody here at the hospital. In his letter, did he, did he say where he was going? I mean, I don't know, is he going back to... New Orleans or someplace farther? Jay, wait. Come on, you're not worried about, about Shane Roberts. No, 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 I'm worried about Vicky. Well, he, he promised that as soon as you and Vicky got married, he'd leave her alone. You know, Michael, he's dying. I mean, all the bets are off. Well, not for Vicky. Right? Maybe for him. I mean, look, you, I mean, your guy's marriage is okay, right? I mean, oh, marriage is great. I mean, it's never been better. All right, well, come on, don't worry. Move on. Get into the future. <laughs> Shane who? There you go. I see. So, you're making the decisions for us now? Well, I'd like to make them together. But obviously, you don't think I'm capable of that well, or anything else. You just sent my kid upstairs. What, are you afraid? Afraid I'd, I'd take him, grab right. him, take All him out right, of here? that's enough. I am the one that was buried alive by Nikos. If I trust that Carl can take care of us, why can't you? Rachel, Carl couldn't take care of you the last time. What makes you think he can do it now? He can and he will. This house is the safest place for all of us, Where Joe. are you going to take them? Well, of course, you could lock them up in a jail cell. Or you could take them to Sophia's, where there is no security at all. And I need my family, Joe. And I need a Paulina. As you so bluntly pointed out, I can't trust my grown children. Neither Matthew or Amanda. I depend on Paulina. I don't like this. Something's gonna go down with Nikos, I can feel it. Then let Carl catch him and this'll be over. Why can't that be good enough for you? <sighs> Hello? Darling. Let me talk to him. But you've assured Joe that the house is safe. I've tried to. All right, I'll be home soon. Joe wants to talk to you. Carl. He hung up. Is that supposed to reassure me? Joe, nothing we say is going to reassure There's you. There's a tap still on the phone, you know. You think he doesn't know that? I can find out everything he said in five seconds. Fine, waste your time. Nikos is the villain here, not Carl. Carl is my family. So is Paulina. As far as I'm concerned, family is all you have, Joe. And either you let 
trouble split apart a family or you let trouble bind it together. As far as I'm concerned, that's a choice. So, it's your call. Joe, please. Rachel needs me. I can't let her down. It's so comforting for me to see that you still get cranky when you have a writer's breakthrough. Well, if you want sunshine, go to the beach. <laughs> I've had writer's block for weeks. Eat it. No. Eat it. No. Eat it. No. I want you to leave me alone, both of you. After I've been here all night inspiring you, you're no fun. You know why Alexander's not calling, don't you? Why? Because of you. Oh, that's please. why. He'll call. No, he won't call. The sooner you leave, he... the sooner he'll call. He'll call. And then I will meet him, and then I will get him to the police. On your own? Yes, on my <clears> own. <throat> now, would you both just get out of my house? Please leave me alone. How many times is that, Carl? Uh, it's 14, uh, I 12? think. 14? Yeah. Hmm. 15 times I have tried to kick you out of my house since we got here last night. Does this tell you something? Yeah. Leave me alone. Did we miss our little nappy? Carl, it's your turn to make the coffee. Oh, my God. Don't tell me. Don't ask. That looks like a... <coughs> yes, if Nikos does get to his plane, he won't get very far. Well, that makes me feel better, Carl. Thank you. Stop whispering. Don't let her see it. Whispering? Who's whispering, honey? Alicia, all we're trying to do is help you. Then get out of my house, please. Sixteen. You know, when that phone rings, I'm out of here, you know yeah, that. Well, we can't allow that. Oh, really? And who is going to stop me? I want you both out of my house, please. Leave me alone, please. Seventeen and eighteen. Stop counting, Cass. Paulina, I don't mean to be like this, all right, but just losing the house, I just feel like I've, I've lost everything. Including me? Why do you say stuff like that? Because you still blame me for the fire. That makes everything I do wrong, doesn't it? What, I can't worry about you anymore? I can't be concerned about leaving you here with Dante? <sighs> but you don't think he's safe with me anywhere, do you? <sighs> it's just, uh, you think this place is heaven. Paulina, you think this... Uh, Everything is here, everything is in its place, so including all the people. Like no, let's not go there, please. that's not what I'm doing, but listen to me. It, there's too many secrets here. Everybody's hiding something. Look at Rachel. You don't think she's, she's, she knows exactly what Carl is up to? It doesn't matter. Where else are we going to go? Sophia's? I don't want my kid raised to be a spoiled, rich kid who thinks the world owes him happiness. Joe, we're not going to live here forever, only until we find our own place. <sighs> Look, I... I have made so many mistakes this year. I wish you would just let me... Please, please do something right. By staying here? Yes. Yes. I can't bring back the house that... that you grew up in. And I can't convince you that I wasn't taking anything that night. But I can be here for Rachel. They're my family too, Joe. I need them, and they need me. What do you think, a, a motel is better? here for now. You're going to stay with us, though, aren't you? Sure, Blue Eyes. Where else would I be? <sighs> okay, I got to get back to work, all right? Uh, yeah, are you going to have to work all night? I don't know, but I think with Matt and Carl and Nikos out there all trying to kill each other, I would not wait up. Uh, hi, Matt. One down. Hey, are you all right? 
How's Dante? He's fine. He's fine. Have you guys seen Carl? No. Do you know where he went? Wish I did, Matt. Matt, tell me something. Is Carl and Felicia, are they trying to trap Nikos? You tell me you're the cop. Oh, why can't I get a straight answer from anybody in this house? Matthew, if you know something, just tell us. I think they're going to use Felicia as bait. That's terrific. Get her to contact him. Beautiful. Look, Carl's keeping me out of the loop. I put that together on my own. Hope you're right. Tell you what, Matt, if you hear from Carl or you hear from Nico, she'll contact me, right? Yeah, sure. No problem. Great. Got to roll. Uh, be careful. You too. I love you. Same here. Are you okay? Joe and I have a lot to do right now. I mean, you know, losing the house and ending back up in the hospital. I have just on, I'm on overload. Hey. Why don't you go upstairs and crash for a little while? Hi, Matt. You got a sec? Excuse me. Sure. Elena Dante's sleeping. He is just too cute. Are you crazy? Why aren't you pretending to be in South America? I am. You didn't see me. Get real. Paulina and Joe just saw you. Now, we are not going to drag Paulina into this. Look, she's going to have to choose sides eventually. I hope not, Matthew. Now, let Carl and Alexander cancel each other out. We win. You don't get it, do you? It's some kind of macho thing, isn't it? Family honor and all that stuff. Now, what would Matt Corey do, huh? Would he bring Nikos to town and let somebody else finish it for him? No, I have to catch Nikos, Amanda. Not Joe and not Carl. Me. <clears throat> yeah. Took you long enough to call. a little swamped at the moment. Uh, no, of course, I, I want publicity for going back to Corey, but... Right. All right, yes, well, thank you, too, sweetheart. Bye-bye. Oh, I need some little PR person. Well, she can't sell books without PR. Don't tell me I should be grateful, okay? Thank you. 12-step slogans of your department, honey. You know, have you <clears> always <throat> thought about the possibility that Alexander may not call me? Of course he'll call you. Of course he will. He's in love with you. He won't be able to resist. But has it occurred to you that you may be unable to trap him? Oh, yeah, I've been waiting for this. This is the new game, isn't it, Carl? You undermine my confidence, so I'll ask you to go after him. Just a thought. You think I'm going to run away with him, don't you? Disappear someplace, is that it? Well, that's probably what he wants. I'm sure he doesn't give a damn about what you want. I'm the one going after him, Carl, not you. Hey, here's an idea. Why don't I go after Nico? So I'll bring him in single-handed. Did I just say that? I think it has to be the caffeine. It's all part of Nico's game, you know. This. I mean, make us wait, keeping us on edge. Oh, so the great Carl Hutchins is getting a little jumpy, isn't he? I sure hope not. What is that supposed to mean? Oh, don't mind me. It won't be long before the police knock at this door. Joe has the house staked out by now, I'm sure. And if Nikos finds out that the police are involved in this in any way, we shall lose Nikos for good. 
Ring! I told you I'd call eventually. Hutchins is out of control. I need your help. Yeah? You haven't so far. Meet me at the clock tower today. It's risky for both of us. Leave immediately. Listen, how about down by the docks? It's safer and, uh... Much more public. Amanda is looking quite lovely these days, isn't she? It'd be a shame if something happened to her. I'll be there. Wait for me. So where do we meet him? We? You're not going anywhere. He was talking about me, wasn't he? Why would he do that? Where are you going? Listen, you didn't see me. You don't know anything about this. You understand? Amanda! What's the rush? What are you doing here? Well, what do you do? Where's Matt? He, uh, he went to catch a plane. Went to catch a plane. No, don't, don't run off. Ah, they're up to something. Ah, they're rich. Ignore them. Hey, they're family. Okay. But I'm sure Joe wishes that they weren't. And as far as he's yeah. concerned, everything I do is wrong. He's convinced that I took a bunch of pills and burned down our house, and that I was too drugged out to remember. Were you? No. I didn't take any drugs. I didn't drink. I didn't take any cold medicine. Just tea. I swear to God. All right. You believe me? Of course I believe you. <laughs> you trusted me for all those Jake. years. Jake. Mmm. Just wish I could trust Vicky. Don't tell me you can't. Oh, now that now that Shane's dying, he decides he wants to leave town. He tells Vicky, and then he splits. Probably thinks she'll follow him. Oh, that Shane's dying. So how long should we be in Morocco? I don't know. Charter course. Charter course. Lila, you can't sail from the Great Lakes all the way to Morocco. You, you can't do it. You can't? No, you can't. Oh, are you sure? Yeah. That's okay. We'll go to Chicago. We'll, we'll get an international flight and... Ah, uh, no, we're going to need our passports for that, Shane. Yeah. Well, that's Shoot. okay. We'll just go to Bay City and we'll pick up... No, uh, no, no, no. I am not going to Bay City for my passport, for my medicine, or for anything else, okay? All right, then. Forget about Bay City. We'll, uh, figure out another way to get to Morocco. <laughs> okay, and then what happens when we get there? Why, I'll just smile at the customs men, and they'll just let me on by. That's a great <laughs> idea, Lila. What happens if it's a customs? Well, then, baby, that's where you're going to have to <laughs> <laughs> Oh, we'll bribe him. How much you got? Oh, for a bribe. Okay. A for bribe, a bribe. A bribe. Yeah, we might need it. Moroccan no. bribe. Right. <laughs> Still take American dollars? Five, six, seven. <laughs> I have $47. And let's see here. I've got a whole lot of pennies. About uh, 57, 58 cents. Ten bucks either. We don't have yeah, mm. Credit card? Two, but they're almost maxed out. Can you put a bribe on a credit card? I don't know. I'm <laughs> sure you'd figure out a way to do that. And what is that supposed to mean? You wouldn't be trying to con me, would you? Into going back to Bay City, <sighs> pick up my passport, no, more money in not. medicine? I do not want to go back to Bay City. Okay? It's okay. the last place I want to go. So what we'll do is we'll use our money, mm -hmm. and then we'll max out your credit card. Oh, boy. And then... And then what? Well, you're not going to like this idea very much. Like but... what idea very much? What? Well, it's been a long time. Shane Roberts, I thought you knew everything there was to know about me. What's in that picture? What picture? What are you talking about? What are you doing? Give me that back. I pick pockets. <laughs> Give me my money. Back. And with a little bit of practice, I might even be able Don't to get the credit card. Cre <laughs> how did you do that? Where did you learn how to do that? Oh, Better where question. do you think I learned how to do that, huh? Once. <laughs> when I was little. And Mama was a little short on cash. Why, I'd just go down to the garden district and 
I'll teach you how to do it. It's no, kind of no. fun. He's going to have to run, though, which no, might be a no, problem no, no, for no, you, of course. This. We're going to go to Morocco, okay? But we are going to go to Morocco like we are now, straight and narrow, not like we were. Okay. Okay. We only might need our passports for that. Oh. Yeah, okay. I suppose if you can put up with a dying man, I can put up with Bay City for ten minutes. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. We'll go back to Bay City, we'll pick up my passports, then we'll leave, okay? okay. But I'm not going to get any medication. Now, are we clear on that? Crystal. Okay. How long has Shane been sick? Well, I guess. What is it, cancer? No, it's some some rare parasitic deal, something that he that he picked up when he was in Central. I don't know. I don't know. Nobody told me. Well, not many people knew. Honey. But you knew. I would have said something to you, but you had so much other, you know, so many other things I going on. I've been so wrapped up in my own problems, I barely noticed he was sick. He's he's really dying. Don't think there's a cure. I had to go to where is he? He uh. He gave his resignation at the hospital, and then he, he, he left town. He's probably on his boat somewhere. Somebody must know how to find him. I just hope that somebody's not Vicky. What? Oh, come on. Oh, come on. He's dying. Vicky wants to spend time with him. How do you know I that? I can tell. I mean, she was, she was destroyed when she got the information. Uh, Jake, Jake, look at me. That doesn't mean she's going to leave you. She's probably telling herself right now how lucky she is that she has you. Yeah, right. Vicky married you. She loves you. You've got to believe that. I know that, Paulina, but this, you know, this just hits it. When Vicky has no reserve left. I mean, do you think this guy could be, you know, pulling some kind of scam? You mean Shane acting like he's dying so he could still make you wait. You still think like a con man, I would. You? I wouldn't put it past him. I would. Listen to me. Listen to me and carefully. Hmm. Vicky walks out on you and she's got me to deal with. You little tough guy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, Joe walks out on you, then that's stupid because Joe's not walking out on you. I hope you're right. I'm always right. <sighs> How nice to see you, man. No guns. No tricks. be hoping that Nikos will go to Felicia. Don't take your eyes off that apartment. Yeah, stay in touch. What the hell is this? What did Nikos suggest is unaccounted for, and we're just finding out about it now? The FAA's checking it out. Well, how about checking out where the hell Nikos is? 
Huh? Is he on the jet? Is he headed to Bay City? These would be good ideas, don't you think? I mean, what the hell's going on? We haven't seen Nico since Greece. Yeah, that's where Interpol lost track of him. If Nikos doesn't show right away, we are crashing Felicia's apartment. Yes, sir. And I want a report from the Corey house every 15 minutes. Everything's quiet over there right now, sir. Well, better stay that way. Got the red Hutchinses over at Felicia's waiting for Nikos to show up. The angel knew it all along. If we bust into her apartment now, we lose Nikos for good. If we don't bust in, then... Carlino, stand by to enter Felicia Gallant's apartment. If anybody leaves, don't lose them. You got that? It was a bad time. But we're real sorry about your house. Yeah, it's, uh, I guess it's just one of those things. Thank God. Oh, you're not even going to offer me any? Mm. Yeah, now you two sound like a pair of six-year-olds. You don't like it? Get out. 31. 33. You know, it's possible that Alexander is not going to come to Bay City. He hasn't sent me any mementos. But you always have parents, right? Well, my parents. Mom and Look, girl. Look, Nikos didn't trap you come in a crypt. Sweetie. Although, I don't. at this point, I can't say I would have minded. No. Oh. Oh, now you don't listen to little cats. He's so cranky, isn't he? Paris didn't mind me at all when I was filling up the old feed bowl. Mm, we're very grateful to you, too. You're welcome. He took good care of you, didn't he? <laughs> yeah. Want to go to Uncle Cat? Yeah, go did. on. Oh. oh. Yeah, the police are going to be knocking at this door any second if Nikos doesn't call beforehand. What have you been up to? No, Let's... no, no. Leave me alone. Let's have a look. <coughs> Chocolate is our friend. Chocolate is our friend. Chocolate is our... Is that all you've been typing? Well, for the last two hours, yeah. I, I did three chapters before that. Yeah, one. let me see. Oh, right here. Read that. Mm-hmm. Chocolate is our friend. Chocolate is our oh, friend. You know what? This is, uh, this is true and very original. You're your beginning to lose Both it, Felicia. out of here right now. Oh, come on. When that phone rings, I'm going to go meet Alexander. No, I'm afraid you're not. I will not allow you to meet the man alone. Allow it? That's right. You're going to start that again? Since when do you allow me to do anything, Carl? No choice of words, Carl. You know what? You're the only one who can catch him? Is that it? He's too dangerous for you. Well, then why didn't you catch him? Why did you let Rachel walk into that trap, huh? It was you who lured Rachel to the church, oh, not I. On. So you do blame him for that, don't you? No. You know I... what? Alexander is your enemy. He's not mine. And you still have feelings for him, don't you? We can't trust you to deal with How him on your own. How many more people are going to get hurt, Cass? Not you. Now, come on, guys. Let's cool it. You want to kill him. He wants to kill him, Cass. And you're using me to do it, and Carl. I know and that. And you're still in love with him, aren't you? Go on, admit it. You want me to get it? No. No. Hello? Darling. Alexander. Are you alone? Yes, of course I'm alone. I miss you. Didn't you know I'd come for you? When can I see you? Meet me at the clock tower. Good, I, I will. Leave now. I'm on my way. Okay. I'm going. You understand? I'm going, and I don't want either one of you to follow me. Get out of here. No! Yes, please I'm sorry, don't do this. Don't. No, no, I'm sorry. Yes, please. Look, don't, don't. I don't need Carl, and I don't need the psycho. But I can't live without you. Yes. No. Oh. You're a traitor. Okay, I don't know how we're going to find my passport and all this mess. All right, you start with the death. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, start with the boxes, all right? You okay? Oh, no, I just broke a nail. It's bleeding. I'm going to go run some water on it. You broke a nail? Don't laugh at me. 